Good morning. Let me go pull up our chat. Come on in the room. Come on in this room. See if I could get y'all a little bit higher. Okay, that's a little better. That's a little bit better. I've got my T. Oh, where's the chat, Tamara? I don't know. There it is. Where's the chat? Focus. It's too early for squirrel brain. Okay, Larissa. I glimpsed your, your audio. It's a little too early for some squirrel brain. It's a little too early. We already getting distracted with the phone in our hand. Good morning, y'all. 704. Norma's like, it's early. It's early here. All right. So, uh, Ureli, good morning. Norma, good morning. Tamara, put the phone away. Okay, okay, okay. We're putting the phone away. We're putting the phone away. Who else? Who else? Larissa, Camelia, Leah. Who else we got? Rebecca, good morning. Who else we got? Uh, Miss Washington, Monique, good morning. Bates, good morning. Jesse Renee, good morning, honey. Tiffany, good morning. Rhonda, good morning. Coffee in the blue, light pink, and dark pink flowered mug. Okay, Shelly, coffee away, Shelly, in your fashion show floral mug. Shalice, good morning. Okay, no problem. Having a fantastic day. Jarena, good morning. Uh, Kirk, good morning. Mr. Techie, good morning. Katrin, Katrin, good morning. Katrine, good morning, good morning. Who else we got? Carolyn, good morning. Donna, good morning. Who, did I miss anybody? I hope I didn't miss anybody. Lori, good morning. Good morning. Holly, is lunchtime for Holly? Holly, what are you having for lunch today? Good afternoon. Good afternoon, Holly. Hey, Piatra Pookie. How are you? Good morning. Piatra, you up early, girl. You up early. You up early. I hope I didn't miss anybody. Y'all know. Probably some salad you don't know yet. Get it together, Holly. Get it together. Why isn't your lunch written in your planner, Holly? Holly, what's happening? Jeanette, good morning. These children are going to be strangled today and shipped to Africa. Please. Okay, so are you shipping them before you strangle them? Or are you going with them, ship them there, and strangle them there? Because that's very important, Holly. That's very important. I mean, I'm sorry, Jesse. That's very important, Jesse. You got to know. You got to know which one you're doing. Miss Murray, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Angie, I see you, Angie. Kim, Kim! What's happening, Kim? Good morning. Good morning. Over here, this. <laughs> Brute. Bruno is over it. Bruno said, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm done with this quarantine business. I'm done. I'm going outside. I'm going to play. I'm going to do things. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Play a housewife so you get up to cook breakfast every morning. You'll be taking a nap soon. Girl, good, good deal with the good housewife, okay? 
Piatra, you on that good housekeeping magazine type situation. That's what you are on. Uh, you got your Villa Beautiful pins. Yes. Let's tell you they brought me alive. Making up stuff to write. <laughs> you making up stuff to write? Lisa. Lisa's over there making up stuff to write, y'all. Oh, my goodness. 13, 15, oh, yes, Jesse, yes, that is the time. God's desire for me, good morning. Corp Diva, good morning. Playing for two weeks, planning for two weeks. It makes you a bit sad as everything is canceled. It's okay, because, listen, we're planner babes. You can find things to plan. You can find things to plan. You can find things to plan. Refuse to stay home. You still waiting on your really beautiful pen and your warehouse order. Yeah, I actually um Rochelle Morning my girl. Good morning Good morning I am let me see if I could separate these two things I was just about to log in When I came on when I started to put together my my, my the live this morning. It was giving me some issues um to connect so I had to go redo the whole thing again so I'm like whatever whatever yeah mine still says printing and in process so I'm just gonna contact them today because I forgot the day that they said it was supposed to be shipped out um, I think it was it was between the 6th and the 10th though so I might just be overly anxious as I normally am that's probably just me being overly anxious Monica good morning They're right, but you always got to try all of them out. Yes, you really. Just to make sure they all work. We do. Your EC is ready to ship. Leslie. Leslie! Why are y'all stuff be shipping and my stuff is still processing? You bought the petite planters and forgot to get the cover. Donna, you were too excited. You were too excited. You were too excited. The 8th to, to the 10th. Okay, introverted. I won't bother them until the 11th then. Ah, I did, Holly. I did. Boris, is, Bar, Boris, even Boris got corona. Good grief. Was the same ship day. So you, you. Ah, ah. Uh, in your page and it had the time uh, Said video was on a yeah, yeah, so it was giving me some issues. It wouldn't take the picture. It wouldn't do all sorts of stuff You want some stuff off zoo Lily man. You just shopping Holly um, How do the Villa beautiful pens compare to the simply I uh, you know, I haven't even used the simply gilded pen to write yet Yes, Norma post some of that picture Post that picture. First of all, wait a second. You, let me tell you. Okay. All right. Wait a second. Okay. So, so, so let me get the scoop. Lord, forgive me. Forgive me, Lord. I hope this is not gossip. Okay. I hope this is not considered gossip, but I need some information on Boris. Okay. Yeah. We're going to do the prayer, but we got to talk about this first because then we might have to ask for forgiveness for this here stuff. Okay. So hold on. We got to talk about something first because I need inquiring minds want to know how is Boris not married to his pregnant woman? Can you tell me this or did I hear wrong? Did I hear wrong? Because when they said Boris was in the ICU and his partner was pregnant, I need to find out how is Boris not married to the pregnant girl? Is, is that you heard it too, Kim? What kind of example is this? What kind of example is Boris setting? What kind of example is Boris setting? You can't be up in office just knocking women's up, living with them and they pregnant. And you trying to prime minister the nation? I'm going to need for you. To prime minister some good example. Okay. I'm going to need for you to do this. Okay. 
is I was like, let me let me try to find out if that's what I heard or that's like maybe I misunderstood something. Maybe it's his business partner and they just happen to live together. But why are he living with his business partner though? Can he afford to live by himself? What kind of business y'all in together? The business of snuggling? What is this? I need to know. No, no, I'm not I'm not trying to judge him. I'm making a statement about the the the, the situation. Okay, I'm making a I'm I'm making I'm making I'm I'm trying to inquire about the situation. <laughs> I'm trying to inquire about this situation. Send it. Good morning. Don't be doing that. Don't be trying to tell young people to do the right thing and you up in there ain't doing the right thing. I'm gonna need as soon as look, as soon as you found out she was knocked up, you should have married her. And first of all, let me just tell you, and I'm gonna talk. It I know I know Leslie, I'm just clearing this one out. Let me let me tell you, isn't he married to somebody? Holly, he better not be. He better not be. He better not be. He better not be. And let me tell you to all young ladies, I'm going to need you to make sure. Listen, you see in this here corona economy? No, sir, we ain't just shacking up. You's about to marry me. Because you could die at any minute and fiancés don't get nothing. Fiancés don't get nothing. Fiancés and baby mamas don't get nothing. Can y'all can y'all help me help people to understand this? In this here, we go into the courthouse. Boris, it could be a video chat justice of the peace. We can mail out the and get the marriage certificate by mail. Boris! Baby mamas don't get nothing. We's about to get married, Boris. And now Boris is sick in the ICU. Side chicks don't get nothing neither. Come with it, Cindy. You ain't got no side chick insurance plan. Y'all play too much. Y'all play too much with this stuff. What her name? I don't even know her name. It better be a bedside wedding. It better be a bedside wedding. They don't get nothing. I'm up in here running. First of all, yo, if I'm willing to risk my life and the life of my newborn baby, because we up in here together, we up in here together. And I'm not just talking about her. I'm not just talking about her, y'all. If we, I'm risking my life, you up in here with the corona. I'm still living with you, loving on you, feeding you. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. If I'm risking my life, boo, you go, you going to put the ring on this. You're going to sign that paper. You're going to marry me. Oh, my gosh. Miss Carrie. Miss Carrie, you is a woman. You having his baby. You have the authority. You have a say so in this situation. I'm gonna need you to get it together and utilize this the power that you got right now. It it's about to be a cell phone ceremony. What? It's about to be a I'm risking my life in this corona society with you. What? I, they live together, Larissa. What you mean? I mean, of course, he was isolated, which you are in your home, but you still, you like, you in the house, sweetie. You in the house, sweetie. You in the house with the corona. You just like the doctors in the hospital with the corona. 
Good morning, Diamond. Nicole is like, see, that's why I don't like come on, coming on in, in these weird parts. <laughs> it, maybe she choose not to get married. She a fool. And yes, I said that. Yes, I said that. Yes, I said that. And I own it. Yes, I said that and I own it. Let me just tell you something. I, you know, understand, I understand that marriage, people say marriage is not for everyone. Okay, just like, listen, for more than one reason, if you don't want to get married, stop having sex. Stop having sex. Because when you have sex outside of marriage, you know what happens with sex outside of marriage? Disease and a whole bunch of other stuff. So I'm not even talking about the spiritual or the, the religious section of it. I'm not even talking about that, okay? I'm not even talking. I'm just talking about the fact that if you're going to have sex with just one person, okay, no problem. That's your business. But when you're having five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 20, 30 different partners, and you don't know what they got, and it takes years for symptoms and things like that to come up, stop. Stop. There's a reason why God said you should only have sex with your husband or your own wife to prevent it. That means if the two of y'all got something, it's only the two of y'all, not 55,000 million other people because y'all done gave it to them. Oh, that's nasty. But anyway, anyway, I'm not getting into that. I'm not getting into that. First of all, I understand that we love each other. I get it. We care about each other. But let me tell you something. Marriage is a part of love. Commitment is a part of love. That's a part of love. So that means you can just up and decide that you want to move on. Period. We have no attachments together. That means we really did not agree to share our lives together. That means that we had just made an arrangement to live together until we get sick of each other. That, that, is that what we doing? Is that what we doing? We just making an, an agreement to live together. You keep what you got. I keep what I got. And so if anything happens, it's like we were never even together in the, in the first place. What? What? No. Uh, who was it that says my husband is my investment? Let me just tell you something right now. What love got to do with it? It's <laughs> you is my investment. Let me just tell you this. Because what this marriage contract says, it says that I am fully and completely giving myself over to you and I expect the same from you. That means I'm committed to your well-being and you should be committed to mine as well because we're in a, we're in a partnership. We're in this thing together. You my struggle buddy. We're going to work this thing out. That's what that means. It means I don't have the right nor the authority to just jump up and leave you just because you get on my nerve. Because you do that like every other day. Sometimes a couple times in the day. You understand? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. It also means that if you decide that you want to mess me over, there's some legal consequences to it. If there's no legal consequence, men be doing dirty. Men be doing dirty. And you know this, Mr. Techie. Y'all be doing dirty. It's cheaper to keep Tamara. Let me just tell y'all that. It's cheaper to keep her. <laughs> Nicole says my mom was engaged forever He died of cancer She did not get nothing All those years with him And she paid for the funeral 
and then found out she didn't even get the house, the 20 acres, nothing. I'm sorry. It's over. It's over. I need some assurity. One of the things that women need the most, and ladies, please, please, ladies, tell me if I'm wrong. One of the things that a woman needs the most is security. One of the things she needs the most is security. A man is a husband. He is the head. He's supposed to take care of everything underneath. He's supposed to be the guiding force to that. We women crave security from our husbands. We want protection. We need to know that our husbands is our, he's our strong tower besides Jesus. You understand? He is our strong tower. He is the representation of God to us here on earth. He is the one that's supposed to provide that force for us, whether y'all want to say yes or no. Okay? And so, therefore, let me just tell you something. Let me just tell you something. If you're supposed to be my security, my protector, my provider here on earth, because Christ is feeding into you and you are supposed to be now doing what Christ has ordained you to do as the husband and keeping it all together, while I am your help meet, your support system to help you get the vision that we've got for our family and our life going together, that's a big investment. And no... No, it ain't for free because you ain't doing it for free. You ain't doing it for free. Because the black lab knows the truth. The black lab knows the truth. You ain't doing it for free. Men ain't doing it for free, ladies. Because we got to pay them. We got to pay them. You haven't found anyone to marry? Okay, Holly, good. <laughs> no stop y'all think no you're gonna put a ring on this you are going to make a commitment to this and that is your sign of commitment just like baptism is a sign of i choose you lord to be my lord and savior of my life you see this wedding ceremony? You know what that says? That says, I choose you. It says, and I'm liable to you. So if anything happened and I mess up too, too much, mm, you guess your payment and, and I, I could go my way. You best to pay me. Hold on a second. Woo! And never ready to mingle. Leslie, let me, let me go look, Diamond. Let me go back to the comment. I did not see the comment. You would have gotten a refund for the funeral. Oh my God. Can you imagine you had to pay for all of that and you got still got nothing? I'm, I can't see it. I can't do it. I can't do it. Mr. Better come home, come with two Popeye's sandwich today. <laughs> Cause I'm gonna be looking at him sideways, but you know, we already got two rings on it. Okay. We got two. Two rings on it, y'all. Okay, two rings. 1998 and and Pookie, Mr. 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 Kirk. When was the next one? 2000. Was it 2004? When was the next one? Two rings on it. At the rate he going right now, he better be gearing up for a third. He 2004. He better be gearing up for a third at the rate he going right now, getting on my nerve. I don't want no classic and a spicy because I, I I think it's the mood for two spices today. No. You had one narcissist. He said one thing wrong and you left him in the middle of Pittsburgh. Two hours away in West Virginia. I cannot, Leslie. I can't. I can't. Anyone can't help me find a husband. You have a weakness for Irish and Italian men. That's probably what you need to stay away from. Both of them. They all got the Rona right now. Holly. They all got the Rona. Calm down. There ain't no dating. There's no dating in the Rona society right now. So calm, calm down. Um, let me go back up. Hold on. I, I saw one of Diamond's comment. Let me see if there's another one that I missed. Let me scroll all the way back up. Let me scroll all the way. What did Mr. Techie do? Mr. Techie didn't do nothing. Boris got me all messed up this morning. It wasn't Mr. Techie. Mr. Techie didn't do nothing today. A couple days ago, yes, but he ain't do nothing today. He didn't do nothing today. And then we're going to pray because Tamara need to calm down. It was Boris. It was Boris. Boris did it. Hashtag Boris did it. That was the old Will and the daughter never knew. 
and some side chick from his old attorney's office was battling it out in court. I can't. I cannot. Mm. I can't. I got my mint tea today. I can't. Mm. Hold on. Justin's sister said she gave, gives us six months because we're getting married on her husband's birthday. I said, when Justin asked me, I said, there is no turning back once I said yes. Okay. Stop by the courthouse to get the paperwork started. I'm telling you. You better do that. Married, then she found out he recently married someone else whilst he was still married to her. Beat down. Beat down. Bigamist. No. Tell him. And start walking. I cannot. Ha Listen. Leslie serious. Online dating until after the after the Rona. Mm -mm. Okay, I'm trying to read it, y'all. Catch up. January engaged the next year and married that later on. I'm telling you. <laughs> You're going to ship the hubby to Africa with the kids? man a bucket and a shovel because he gonna need to build a hut he gonna need to build a hut for him and the kids give him some give him give him a chance to survive girl give him a chance to survive oh my goodness that's funny but yes y'all yeah i mean you know there are practical reasons to look at things or ways to look at things other than coming from which i love i love the way god looks at things and 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 the way god um, instructs us to live. I love it. But if you don't even believe in that, look at the stuff from a practical standpoint. Oh, look at the thing from a practical standpoint. Come on now. Get your life together. You think you doing something? You ain't doing nothing. You got to be engaged for 55 years. Who lived together for 55 years? That's foolishness. Foolishness. You better get over that fear or whatever it is. First of all, is Oprah even married yet? Did Oprah even marry the Stedman yet? Is they did is they still dating? Oh my goodness. That's Boris and Carrie and Oprah and Stedman. What is this? What is this? What? Anyway, so Wait until you are legally divorced before you knock up another. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Like there's a time and a season for everything. I'm going to need you to calm down. Calm down. Calm down. <sighs> 30 minutes later. Let's calm down. And then let's pray. Let's pray. <laughs> to share her book. Listen, there's prenups for that. Okay. And first of all, Stedman, he been, he been there. He been steady. Stedman been steady. Stedman has been steady. The man, and I think the man asking her to marry her, okay, from way back when, from 1920. I don't think I don't think um, uh, uh, Stedman's uh, statement can handle the amount of Oprah charges that there are on a monthly basis. <laughs> Yes, Larissa, they've been together since 1920. <laughs> his daughter by the little father. <sighs> his dad cheated on his wife and they divorced. Their seven-year-old told that if he married the mistress, they would cut him off. So it's been almost 30. That's not, that's not nice. That's not nice. That's not nice. You can't do that. I, I, I understand the situation. I understand the situation. Yeah, but you can't do that. Because you can't, mm -mm. I understand the situation. I understand the situation, but mm -mm. seven kids together. Oh my goodness. My goodness. Oh, first of all, first of all, let me just tell you, first of all, what's happening. The two of them could have been married and nobody knows. No one has to be there no, to witness it. No one's going to get your marriage certificate. No one is going 
to know. You don't got to change your last name. Like, please tell me. Please tell me. Like, are they out there looking at your, your taxes? <coughs> are they doing your taxes? What's happening? What's happening? Really and truly, what's happening? Like, you can be married and no one knows. How, ask me how I know. That your favorite cousin passed away. He was trimming a tree, fell off the ladder, and broke his neck. Pray for his family and three kids. Kim! Wow. I will. <clears throat> he has a huge farm um, together, and those boys will fight to get it. Yeah, I mean, um, as the funeral has to wait. Yes, yes, yeah. Yeah, we're going to pray. We're going to pray. We're going to pray. Who? yeah, definitely sorry for that. Let's get the Holy Spirit up in here, okay? Because, ooh, Lord. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for this morning. Father, Lord, we ask uh, in the mighty name of Jesus that you forgive us of any sins and transgressions, whether it's the foolishness that comes out of our mouths, Lord. The things that we have in our hearts, the things that we think of in our mind, forgive us for them, Father, Lord. The things that we have done, help us to be forgiving also towards each other, dear Lord. Heavenly Father, as we come to you this morning, I ask that you continue to prick the mind and the conscience of, 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 of the whole world, Father Lord. Um, we ask, Father God, that at this particular point in time, that you be with those who are so much in need of you. Right now, we see that Kim's aunt is grieving, Heavenly Father. And the family is grieving, Father Lord. So we ask that you would please guide and protect them through this time. Heavenly Father, we see that people are not only dying from the coronavirus and the uh, side, uh, the effects of that, but just regular things each and every day people are um, struggling with, Heavenly Father. So we ask that you please continue to be with us all. Soothe our hearts and our minds, Heavenly Father. This morning we come to you giving you glory. And thanking you for yet another beautiful day that you have created for us. Even in the situations, your word says, in all circumstances and situations, we ought to give thanks. And so we give you thanks today, um, Heavenly Father. Guide and protect our words as we go out and, um, through the rest of this day. Help us to be productive as well. In Jesus' name, amen. Y'all, amen. Amen. Until you finally marry the father of your children last year after 17 years of shacking up. It's respect for self, your partner. Amen. I love the way you put that. It's respect for yourself, your partner, and your family. Yep. Yep. And so much more. And so much more. Saw this morning a 22-year-old with a newborn died in Tulsa from the... Wait. Did the newborn die as well or just the 22-year-old? Oh, man, that's sad. Oh, man. A little kid did die too, though, um, from the side effects of corona. Oh, just the 22-year-old. Okay. Wow. It's serious out here, okay? It's serious out here. So we just have to make sure that we are very careful. He worked at Quick Trip. Okay. Okay. Two little kids have died. Yes, I heard that little little children have died. Not as, you know, a lot. Praise God. Right? Not a lot. Praise God. <clears throat> yeah. Man. Ooh-wee. Okay. I think we calm down now. <clears throat> I think we is calm down, y'all. I think we is calm down. Seven week old. Mm. Hospital, three staff and one resident, but you know it's going to be bad there now. And a lot of, oh no, Nicole. His mom had the virus. Oh, find it. And then I will try to put it in the link. Um, as well. I got to put it in the link. So my, I'm, I'm pretty open to listening to things, right? I'm pretty open to listening to things. 
and then you know doing my own investigation on things and making my own decision or just waiting and watching to see how things turn out um, in certain aspects so just keep an open mind with all the things that I'm going to be sharing with y'all over the next couple um over the next I guess couple weeks that I receive these are things people send me I don't go looking for them but folks send me and I, I watch and I look and I listen um, as well so we'll see how that turns out um, once I shared all that information with you all Southwest okay Southwest we ain't about to do that right now ah um, mandated to wear mask and gloves yes everybody should that works in any kind of those kind of settings you really should to protect yourself the right kind of gloves did you all see the viral video with the nurse um, about wearing the gloves, paper bits about people wearing the gloves. Tanya, good morning, boo. Glory, good morning. If I didn't say good morning to you, anybody who I missed as y'all came in, overheating from last it last night. Girl, wow. Yeah. Um. So pretty much, she did a video that shows about wearing the gloves in public you know she said wear your gloves be safe if you so choose to but it's your cross your cross creating cross contamination because you touch something that has all those bacteria germs and virus on it then you end up touching your phone you touch your pocketbook you touch the cart you touch, touch your groceries you touch all those things you touch your face you itch your nose you you know do all that stuff and then you cross contaminate all your all of your body you take off the gloves right you, you but once you take off the gloves, your hands are clean. But at the same time, if you are, you pick up your cell phone after you take off your gloves, mm, then all the stuff that's on there, yeah. I uh, awful mask and bandanas people wore. At, mm, yeah, she said it, it it doesn't work unless you are washing your hands after everything you touch. Unless you wash your hands after. Can you imagine walking through the grocery store? You pick up one thing off the shelf, pump, sanitize your hands. Another thing, pump, sanitize your hands. Another thing, pump, sanitize your hands. Like everything you pick up and look at, you would have to sanitize your hands. You got to sanitize the cart, sanitize the sanitizer bottle. Yeah. And but then here's my thing though. If you're wearing your mask, you don't have you don't have any gloves on your hands. If the coronavirus gets on the mask and you touch the mask to take the mask off of your face, what's happening? Undressing and showering immediately when he gets home. Exactly. Yeah. Dispose your glue in there and sanitize your hands. Yeah, you gotta kind of, you gotta think, you gotta think, you gotta really think about how to to do those things. You know, you gotta think how to do those things properly. Like when I send my son to the mailbox, I send him with a grocery bag, right? So he would put the grocery bag on, grab the mail, and the mail goes in the grocery bag. So then usually the mail would either sit outside for three days, or I got my spray bottle with some some Lysol and stuff. <laughs> You spray that stuff in there. So you do the little you can. You do the little you can properly. And then, you know, wash up. Same thing. When we go outside, we come back in. Uh, shoes, everything goes off into the machine. And we go into the shower. Yeah, man. What do you mean? Yes, you put, you put, you put, you put the bag on your hand. And you grab your mail. And then you put the bag on the mail. <laughs> Ain't nobody got time to put on gloves to go to the mailbox and then toss away no gloves. Ain't nobody got time to buy all that stuff right now. You use the grocery bag. All them grocery bags you got from the grocery store, you know they come in for a reason. Sanitize sanitizer is just temporary, but washing your hands with soap and water is the most effective. It's most effective. Villa Beautiful is having a release. Did Villa Beautiful send an email out about that new release? Did I just miss it? 
Is that what's happening? Shop Villa Beautiful, April release. I'm so through. Oh my gosh, I'm through. What is this blue one? I'm so through. Wait, oh no, this just says Shop Villa Beautiful. Hold on. Hold on. I cannot with Villa Beautiful, okay? I'm just going to tell y'all right now. Okay, let's put you back. Somewhere. Box T just delivered. Mm-hmm. Grocery bags in the garbage and then in the trash can. Um, if you let it stay outside, let just let it stay outside for a couple days in your garage if you got it. You're still waiting on your EC order to ship. Me too, Nicole. Just stay at home with your people and all your planners. Mm. You don't have room for everything. Okay. Essential worker. Yeah, let me, um... Let me go back to this mail because the store is stocked with some pretty pens to keep you busy. Okay, so those are the same ones. April, Villa Beautiful, new release date, high life, as if dude, valley girl, stay cool. So what are we supposed to do with this now? It, does, it doesn't show you the pen colors or anything. I guess it's just telling you, it's just telling you some colors I don't know I don't know I don't know but we'll see we'll see I need to calm down with that though it's a restock caramel is like we just found another love to love on She's clearing out the old stuff. She need to be pricing the old stuff a little bit cheaper, don't you think? A half-off flash sale. Fire! Half-off. They'll be gone. Put it a half-off. That's what I was thinking too, Becky, is that they were the um, pen colors. But I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, so today, today is the last of the um, Erin Conjuring um warehouse sale today's the last day for the erin conjuring warehouse sale um shrink wrap and zip your planners that way i'm gonna do the same husband to happy birthday husband happy birthday yeah so it's the last of the ec warehouse sale that is something you're on ec site right now uh introverted don't forget if you're gonna buy something go through my link thank you very much Oh, let me check something too because I think um I want to check something. And then I will be able to give you all proper instructions. Then I can give proper instructions. Okay, so here's an easy way to get to my, um, and I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and update it between this week and next week. Here's an easy way. If you want my Erin Condren link, just go to thepaperandpengirl.com. Go to the website, thepaperandpengirl.com. You go there and you click on links. There's a tab mark links and you go there and boom, the Erin Condren link is there and the Cultivate What Matters link is there for the power sheets. I also update that with my Villa Beautiful link sometime so that it makes it easier for y'all to go ahead and just go to the site, click on the link, and go to where you need to, do, to go. Thank you. I, thank you, you really. So, do you know if the new coil daily will be the same size as the petite folio? You really? It is a coiled life planner. The life planners are seven by nine. It's a coiled life planner. Mm -hmm. 
bought the EC sticker album. Diamond, that's in my in my my one of my orders that's to come. So I'm not sure about it, but it's in mine to come right now. Um uh act cheaper when Nicole. Nicole, this is this 50% is usually the cheaper you cheapest you get. They're about to launch the new ones and the old ones are not gonna be on the site anymore. Um, introverted on my website, the paper and pen girl.com. Click on links and, and just click on the, the, the EC banner you see there. Yeah. The life planner will probably in, and let me know everyone if you've seen it cheaper. Um, yeah, usually after they go 50% right now, they do not go any cheaper and once they're out of stock, they're out of stock. There's no more reprinting. There's no more none of that. None of that. It's just going to go away. And only the new ones is going to be available on the site. So once the teacher planner comes out, the old teacher planner will not be available anymore. Um, so when, anytime anything new comes out, the old one goes away and they're not available anymore. Kim probably used her $10, a $10 off uh, coupon that got she got to her email. Probably had an insider um, coupon too. Come on, Kim, spill the beans, Kim, spill the beans. Spill the beans. Spill the beans. So yesterday we talked about, um, I think it was yesterday. <laughs> okay, yeah. So, um, yeah, she had an insider coupon. Mm -hmm. uh, we talked about the new design. We talked about, I'm hungry. We talked about the new design. So, um, hey, Janae, good morning. We talked about the new design. Um, Fran, good morning. Uh, was anyone not here? Did anyone get everyone get to see the new design, the new theme for 2000 and um for 2000 and 2020, 2021? Why is this chair squeaking? Let me move forward. Good morning, good morning. Yeah, so we saw the new EC design and I'm loving the new EC design. Um, as well, you didn't see the design, you just got here. Okay, so there was a link from yesterday. Let me go back. Oh man, um, let me see if no, it doesn't have it on here. <laughs> no diamond. <laughs> okay. Um, Norma, I didn't even get one. So let me try to, 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 to do, if anyone has the link from up from yesterday, can you post it in the chat? If not, oh, ciao. Um, I'm gonna have to try to make it a small link again, but let's address one thing at, at a time. Um, the insider email, um, for the sneak peek, I did not even get one. I didn't even get one. So I think what happens is they roll it out in phases and then sometimes some is just possibly missed. So I would suggest you just go ahead. If you didn't get one, just go to customer service and say, hey, I'm an insider. I did not get the that email. Could you please check to make sure? Like, is there a way for you to make sure? Those things I'm thinking automatically should come. And if it does not automatically come, I don't know what they can do to fix it. I don't know what they can do to fix it, right? And so, um, I just, that's what you're going to do. I just look, I look on Facebook. I rely on other people. They tell me, hey, look, did you see X, Y, and Z? Okay, let me go take a look. Now, what you should be concerned with, what you should be concerned with if you don't get is like, as an insider, they're going to be coming with this new release. You're going to be able to get, um, and, uh, oh my goodness. You're going to be able to get, uh, two days. I think it's like two days. 
about the warehouse sale till two days. Yeah, I, I didn't get mine till late too, Norma. So I think they said they do it in batches. They do it in batches. Okay, Di Diamond, do me a favor. Forward me to my email address right now, if you don't mind, the link to that Erin Condren sneak peek so and and i will i will um forward it to the people send it to the paper and pen girl at gmail.com and i will go ahead and put it in here i'll copy it and put it in here facebook and instagram will spill every single bit of the tea so you don't gotta worry about it they're always gonna do that on top of that uh thank you diamond so so they they'll do that. The ones the ones you should worry about is if you don't get the one that gives you a link to order early to the o early ordering when the new release happens. Insiders get to order 2 days before everybody else on the regular website. In addition to that, insiders get um get a special free gift get a special free gift as well. So that's the email that uh, that I'm going to be concerned about because everything else, everybody will tell me, but I don't want to three days later and I didn't know that everybody was ordering the new new, that, I'm, that I would be very concerned about. So how do you get to be an EC insider? When you are signing up for your Erin Condren account, Free gift for ordering, Norma. Usually they'll tell you if you order your life planner within the insider period, the two days, you get a free gift when you order. And they'll tell you what the gift is so you can decide if you want it or not. When you're signing up for your Erin Condren account, there's two check boxes. There's two check boxes. Thank you, Diamond. There's two check boxes, and the check box will ask you if you want to sign up to be an EC insider and if you want to sign up for the newsletter. Be sure to check both of those boxes when you are signing up. Now, I'm going to go to my EC account and then I'll tell you where to go um, if you have not signed up for it once you in initially, if you didn't sign up for it initially. Um, because I think it is in your account. Um, shopping, EC inside of rewards. Okay. When you sign up, like last year, they gave away that Druzy. Um, what's a Druzy? What's a Druzy? Skeleton. Yeah, they're on skeleton staff right now. So they're just trying their best to do what they can do, right? It's not, it's not business as usual. But anyway, if you did not or have not signed up to be an EC insider, go to the erincondren.com website, okay? And that's, this is only if you already have an Erin Condren account. If you don't have an Erin Condren account, go to my website, click on the link, click on links, Click on the Erin Condren link that's there. You want to make sure, make sure that you're signing up to be able to get that $10 coupon code. So if you don't have an Erin Condren account, do not sign up for one yet. Do not sign up for one yet. No clue when you were signing up. You thought you were signing up for, uh, for an account. Right. So if you already have an Erin Condren account and you are not sure whether you sign up for the EC Insider or not, when you go to the website, if you scroll all the way down to the bottom, the bottom of the page, you're going to see, hold on here. I can't, I'm, I'm on. Okay. Let me come off the charger. You're going to see EC insider rewards. Okay. So you're going to click on this. Let me make sure, hold on. Let me see if it's going to give my account information. No, it's not. So then you're going to have on this page where you can view your rewards, right? Or you can, it, it tells you information about what you earn when you get to the different insider levels, okay? When you get to the insider levels. So it gives you all that information. You can view your rewards, it answers questions, frequently asked questions, all that stuff. But that's what you're going to do is you're going to make sure. Um, so here's the email address, info at erincontra.com. You can send them an email over there. So you're going to do that and then you're going to click on your view rewards. You have rewards so you must have joined? Yes. You delete them after you read them. You have uh, the memory of an ad. Okay, let me click on view my reward stuff. Hold on. Let me see what I got in here. Uh, so that's just telling you how to earn points, etc. 
and then it tells you what kind of okay this whole page isn't whole so then it tells you it tells you you've been an insider since what date right ah! still not working right so it tells you all that stuff. I'm trying not to 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 have my personal information all up in here. But anyway, that's where you're going to go to. You're going to go to do that. If you are on your main account, okay? Account information here on this old oh, child. It's not working well this morning, y'all. Okay, there we go. If you look on the left side when you go into your account, you look on the left side, you'll see your insider summary rewards, activity, etc. You can go in there and double check it as well. So you could check it from there if you already have an account. You're checking your trash. Be sure to check your trash. Oh, goodness, the sun. Check your spam. Check all of that. Because sometimes it will go to spam. Even if you place a gazillion orders and your order email doesn't go to spam, sometimes it will go to um spam all right so let me get this link and then i'll post the link inside here for you all to take a look at um copy link copy link address let's see if we could do that paste oh that's too big it's still too big, so I got to make it small. How can I make it smaller? Oh, you know what I'm going to do? Hold on a second. Let me see if I can do edit this video. Hold on, y'all. I won't be able to see your comments for a little bit. Hold on. Paste, save. Okay, so do me a favor, refresh the video, look in the video description and see if you, tell me if you can click on the link that's in there. It's a long, crazy link. Look and you see it, tell me if you can click on it. So refresh, let me go back to the video. Oh, this sun, though. Does that work? But yeah. FedEx play too much. FedEx is playing. No link. You Did you refresh? Let me know if you refreshed it. You see the link? Can you click on it? Let me know if you could click on it. Let me know if it works. If it doesn't work, then I'll try to, I'm trying to do the tiny URL thing. It works, okay. I'm like already trying to make this URL tiny to be a tiny URL. So I'll just do that anyway and post repost that because y'all, this thing too long. 381 characters. That's how big, copy this. Let me go over to morning tea. But look, it made it little tiny. It made it tiny. Okay, it made it kind of tiny. Okay, well, we good. We good. All right. They delivered your stuff to the wrong address. Okay, so wait, when they delivered your stuff to the wrong address, are these people squint your eyes together? 
<laughs> Diamond, you play too much. You up there with FedEx, Diamond. Look, you up there with FedEx. She said, squint your eyes. Squint your eyes, girl. Squint your eyes. You play too much, Diamond. I'm already trying to, trying to squint fashionably. Trying to do the fashionable squint. You know, the fashionable squint and, and brace back. Mm, trying to do the fashionable one. Like, hold on. Let me see if I can see this real good, real quick. Hold on. Let me try to see if I can see this real quick. Mm. It's on a plane. Ah. Oh, man. The pharmacy had your phone number. Wow. Yo, hubby ordered amp and he just left. UPS driver carried it upstairs for you. Oh, snap. Oh, man. Yeah, that, that has to be a whole... If if the person they delivered it to decide that, no, we keeping this. We don't know nothing about no delivery, wrong delivery here. We didn't get nothing. Then they got to do a whole claim and a whole stuff, 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 stuff. But, you know, the poor UPS drivers and FedEx drivers, y'all, they tired. Can you imagine how tired they are, though? They're tired, y'all. Because people are ordering two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten times more than they normally order. So they're working more and harder than they normally would do. So we got to we gotta see with them, too. We got to bear with them as well. We got to bear with them as well. Because they're working hard. So maybe they were just delirious at that time. I think they probably were just delirious at that time. Brought it over to their house. Yeah. 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 You live in the country, so it's shocking to see them out there every day of the week. Yes. Mm-hmm. Interferes with your personal time. <laughs> Lisa, because you need to be working. She's like, this is my personal time. I don't know what y'all say. You called FedEx twice yesterday and know your Wonder Woman Petite in there, too. Listen, the FedEx delivery lady needs the Wonder Woman petite planner, petite journal, okay? Because they being Wonder People with the purple folio. Norma, right now, I'm I'm crying, but I'm 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 bearing I'm bearing it. I'm bearing it. I'm bearing it, Norma, because I gotta understand they out there struggling right now. They out there struggling. It's a struggle. It's a struggle out there right now. It's a struggle. So I got to I got to bear with them cuz they out there doing the stuff that I'm like I'm not delivering no package to you right now. I don't know who's been at your front door 30 minutes ago. They could have had the Rona. <laughs> and here I go 15 minutes later stepping in the same atmosphere. Oh, I don't know about this. I don't know about this. Mm-mm. I don't know about this. Soon as she gives me yours. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Black, I'm going to need you to give me mine first, ma'am. Okay? Give me mine first. Nothing you use. Optimus Prime. Bring me my platter stuff. <laughs> Diamond, you need to bear with them so let me tell y'all what i did yesterday right let me tell you what i did yesterday so yesterday diamond was on on the morning tea yesterday morning and diamond was like you know she you know she was like now i don't know what to do and then she was also on instagram a uh, friday i think it was friday uh as well anyway so i knew diamond was having a hard time with this um was having a hard time with the new planners because she was like now what am i gonna do like now i want like two of them 
first I didn't, I don't need none, but now I want like two of them. So yesterday I went on Diamonds Live, y'all, and I was like, so Diamond. <laughs> So what I'm going to do, I'm going to get these two and Tamara, I'm going to send them directly to your house because you're about to Franken plan them. And I'm like, but wait, Diamond, I, you ain't supposed to be getting no platters. <sighs> she ready. She ready. She was like, mm-mm. She was like, mm-mm. No. No. Mm. Mm-mm. <laughs> I did. I did. I did get a little messy on Diamond's channel yesterday. I was like, Diamond. I do not need these. See? And then they started. And then. But wait a second. But why did y'all talk about me like that, though? Why y'all talk about me like that? Then they got into the whole thing of talking about me. Like, but wait. I asked about the EC planner. I did make you go in. I did. What, how you get to start talking about me? Okay. And she said, <laughs> y'all. <laughs> Diamond says she needs to go to Tamara Anonymous. <laughs> Where they do that at? <laughs> Where they do that at, Diamond? Where they got a Tamara's Anonymous at? <laughs> Yes, I will. I will. I will definitely do the uncalling and calling for her. Where they do that? What y'all? What are you people gonna do in plan in, in, in Tamara Anonymous? Watch, watch the morning tea. <laughs> what y'all gonna do? Watch the morning tea in Tamara's Anonymous. Y'all know it's not gonna work. <laughs> it's not gonna work. <sighs> It's not, it's just not going to work. Like Tamara's Anonymous is not going to work. I don't even know why y'all trying to lie to yourselves at all. Yeah, I, I did, Char. Char, I did. Yes, I did. I thought I was, look at her. Look at her. She doing the most. Look at her. Won't be able to watch the morning tea. Y'all going to be going through a whole bunch of withdrawals. It's okay because you know you're going to go home and watch the replay. You're going to go home and watch, Kim, you're going to go home and watch the replay. You're going to go home and watch the replay. First of all, Tamara just gives the information. I will tell you when I'm enabling. I, I, I'll tell you straight up when I'm in, enabling. Other than that, I give you the information. I give you the information so you can make wise decisions. Okay? Wise decisions. Okay? <laughs> Morning enabling. <laughs> hey, we're going to change this to enabling TV. It's, it's going to be PPG enabling TV. <sighs> I'm anonymous one vlogger. I'm telling you, you don't need any planner thinking about buying not one. No, mm, no, no. Okay, so what I'll do when I'm going to be enabling people, I will put in the topic morning tea enabling session. And then that way you could choose not to come in. How about we do that? Jan Janelle, but see, Janelle, it's not my fault, though. That's not my fault, Janelle. <laughs> Group buying therapy. <laughs> what is that? Hold on. Oh, oh you still. 
still gonna come. In. Look, do you see what I'm saying? I can't. I can't help you. I, it's not my fault. Don't. Uh, you don't need a planner. Yes, Leslie. <sighs> Did I buy the easy stuff? Get one for that price. So you finally came. To oh my goodness. Yes, but it is a good price though. Feel a beautiful train too. It's a trap. We will still want to know what we visit. You really? <laughs> oh my goodness. Y'all, somebody's at the door. Y'all got to hold on. Norma, anytime you open up your mouth about EC, I'm influencing. Y'all, hold on. Somebody's at the door and all the baby. Boys, they sleep it. Hold on. No, no, <laughs> no y'all not getting no unboxing. I'm not enabling nobody. I'm not enabling nobody. Tamara is not about to enable any anybody. Whoo! Damage the contents of the box. Shar is worried about the box instead of worried about me. Shar. Oh, no, that, listen, that was the FedEx people. The FedEx people came. The FedEx people came. No, okay, all right. So this that I've received is PR stuff. It's not my order, it's PR stuff. So I can't wait to rip it open, but y'all can't see what it is. Well, ladies, stand outside the window. Open up. <laughs> I'm just, I'm just sharing a view of the box. We talked about the FedEx people, and the FedEx showed up. So no, I, no, I'm gonna enjoy this. I'm gonna enjoy looking at it when I'm done. I'm gonna enjoy looking at that when I'm done. Y'all, I don't know what y'all gonna do. Yes, that's correct. It's PR yellow EC box. It's an EC PR box and it's yellow. And it's yellow. Yellow's not the color of this month, so I'm not sure what's happening. <sighs> Is it <ha> <laughs> Is it heavy? Just give me, just tell me something. Just tell me something. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. She said, uh, let me see, let me see if it tells me how many pounds it is on the pack package. Huh. Let me see how many pounds on the package. Uh, it doesn't say how many pounds it is on the package. I'm sorry, you don't get, but no, it's not that heavy. It's not that heavy at all. It's not that heavy. It is yellow. <laughs> she said, is it heavy? She said, 
how do I know it's because because I know it's coming. They told me this one was coming. They told me this one was coming. So some of them we know that's coming. Um, but you know, this is what caused the problems in relationship dangling carrots. Let me. Uh huh. Ooh, child. Hold on. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Oh, I see something purple. Okay. 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 One. I got five. One, two, three, four. I got five things in it. See, that's what. <laughs> I got five things in it. Ooh, child. I love it. Good deal. So that means I got to film an unboxing video for y'all. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> oh. Oh. Um, I've got, I'm still waiting on that. I'm still waiting on that date. Not I'm waiting on the date. I need to know the date. You won't tell. When can you film it? Um, is is when can I show it? <laughs> From me. <laughs> Janelle, flash it across the screen real quick, like like a teaser. I cannot. I can't with y'all. I can't with y'all. No. So no, no. I will tell you that it's not the new. 29 2020 2021 life planner stuff it's not that so y'all don't get too excited don't get too excited yet okay <clears throat> don't get too excited that yet i'm i'm a carrot daughter i'm the carrot daughter so a dangler the carrot dangler i'm uh, gonna have ec's snagging her influencer tag so therefore i will have a unboxing video to film as well um <clears throat> okay because i mean but i've, I've okay i've been telling y'all what is the purpose of being ppg tv lady if we can't get no sneak peeks because <sighs> terms and conditions of being an influencer no y'all listen if you calm down no, it's not an EC surprise box. They're not coming out until another two months, I think. We just had a surprise box. Calm down. If you calm down and look at what is being released, you will know what I just got. Remember, releases go in order. Exactly. I'll share when EC allows me to share. Now, remember, releases come in order, and the videos are going to come in order of the releases. Okay, the the videos will come in the order of what's being released. No, 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 no. You have a great video idea. Let's do an unboxing live. <laughs> If y'all pay attention, then y'all will know what I, you know, y'all will know things. Y'all just got to pay attention and write it down in your planner, okay? So, you know, you know, you know. <sighs> For 200. <laughs> yeah, so I'm very happy. I just got this, so I will be filming that video between today and tomorrow. Um, Remember, I was sharing with y'all on Instagram. I was sharing this on Instagram yesterday. If you guys are not following me on Instagram... Um, do so because I do, you know, live sessions over there. Yes, the Teacher Life Planner is releasing on April 14th. So if you know any teachers, um, even um, teachers that are teaching at home right now, teachers, parents that are becoming homeschool teachers, we still have for the old season, we have, um, what do we have? We have the 50% off sale that's going on right now. Six more minutes. Thank you, Shelly. We got the 50% sale that's going on right now, so they can take advantage of that. That would um, for the, the the old teachers planner, they can definitely redate that the dates on it if they so choose to, 
or wait for the new release of the new um, teacher planner that is coming out on the 14th of the month. So please make sure that you guys are looking out for that and do that as well. Um, as I said, I may or may not, depending on how things roll, get one for my friend uh, because she is homeschooling like five kids right now um, at this point and they do work on their daily schedules, etc. And so one is a senior. <clears throat> um, so I think that that will be good for her as well. So look out for that coming up. Then later after the EC teacher planner release, you are going to be looking forward to the 2020, 2021. It's so hard to say those years. Um, life planner releases. The life planner is, a, is the 18 month planners. You will also and should also have a 12 month option open up at that time as well usually that release happens in may of the uh, of the year however on a live erin condren did say that they are moving up the release dates because of the situation that is currently happening and that there will be twice the amount of accessories so let me just say over the next couple weeks from this place, stop spending money on other things and just save your money for EC. Put it aside, take it out your paycheck. EC does also have Afterpay that they've come out with. Use Afterpay responsibly on any website because Erin Condren is not the only one that uses Afterpay as well. Um, so please make sure that you're deciding on whether or not you're going to get something, what you're going to get. I would, um, I would suggest that when the life planner do, uh, does release, you start seeing, um, whether it's videos or you start seeing uh, the life planner on the site, you already are seeing some of the sneak peeks. Take the time to look at those pictures that you are shown very well. Take this time to really and truly decide, number one, what am I, what's the purpose of getting this planner? Is it to plan which areas of my life? What can I, how can I use the pages? Which one am I going to be able to use long-term colorful, neutral, or this floral, right? Or am I really wanting to do the hour, the hourly, or am I wanting to do the, uh, uh, daily when the daily comes out? Cause I'm really a daily planner at heart. Make sure you're spending the time to look at the pages that you have seen. There's probably going to be another sneak peek sometime. Um, <clears throat> sometime. I don't know the schedules of everything. We don't know that. We don't get all the insider information from EC. Um, so you can open the box early then. Uh, it No, everything is a date specific. Everything is date specific. We get the go ahead. Sometimes, you know, we don't get the go ahead until that day or whatever the case may be. It's like, boom, emails out. Hey, you could go ahead and do this. Um, <clears throat> so everything is kind of fluid, especially in this kind of economic climate right now. Things are a little fluid. But we got to wait for the go ahead for stuff. But you make sure you go ahead and try to do that to make your decision as much as yes. You know, we like to buy all the things, y'all, really and truly. I want y'all to make sure you're making a good decision and you're happy with the purchases that you have made to say that, yes, I'm getting this, I'm going to be using it, and, 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 and it's going to bring me my source of joy. We were talking about this on Instagram yesterday. If you missed my last, I think, two video, um, my two videos, my two lives over on Instagram, go ahead and rewatch those because I think I got some good information in there. Miss Dawn giving me a hard time all the time. Um, as well, about making sure that what you are purchasing is going to work for you and also if you want to buy it just because it's pretty and you want to have it because you're going to like looking at it make sure you're okay with that too um uh, as well okay and have some room or space for i bought it i thought it was going to work for me but it's not working for me make sure you're having space for i need to switch out so i'm going to use this one for one month and this one for one month or three months at a time in each one even though they serve the same purpose i'm just gonna toggle between the two because that's what worked best for me make sure you guys are going through the motion i've already started and this is why i pulled out this planner anyway to share with y'all 
I've already started um, working on on sticky notes. Um, good Lord, where did I put these little sticky notes? I had these sticky notes. Um, let's go to April. Is it in April? Yeah. So I've already started on sticky notes, writing down how I'm going to use the a particular planner. How will I use it? Once I, I start doing that before I even get the planner in my hand. So I write on it, what am I going to do with each of these pages? What can I do? What would make more sense? And make sure all that information is going on, you know, being on purpose. Uh, all the pages are going to be used purposefully. So do that for yourselves as well. Um, Char, I stopped using the sticky notes in like just to write things on and not have a place where it needs to be. So planning out these things. I can easily change out sticky notes, but I can't change out my page if I mess my page up. So when I'm sure of what, exactly what it is I want to do, then I'll write it on a solid page. So I have that as instructions or directions. But in the meantime, while I'm still thinking and still processing, it goes on a sticky note because a sticky note can easily be tossed, but I ain't tossing my planner page. That's how we do this. Um, as well. So I I also outlined the three things that I think I would I'm hoping that I can use um, from July on down, which is going to be the teacher lesson planner, new life planner daily, and also my daily petite planner. And of course, more videos will come on how I'm going to be doing that um, as well. You know, walking you through that whole process. So please make sure y'all do the do that. Make sure y'all do that. Um, all the ways plus Michelle and Han got 50 and 20 ways to use your planner video. Exactly. I'm going to stick with the petite and your cousins. Great, Shelly. Great. Um, you personally like daily planning. You use it to write down your work accomplishments. Feedback from your supervisor. Awesome. You only use one planner a year. Good for you, Norma. I wish. I wish, honey. If anyone needs sticky notes, let you know you bought a treasure chest of posted from Staples and you still have a bunch left. Mm-hmm. I hate when I don't pre-plan and mess up your page. Mm-hmm. And so, yeah. So, that's what I like to make sure that I have everything written out and it, you know, are going out the window, pulling my hair out. No, don't let it go out the window. Um, Diamond, send Lisa a message i were the harris at gmail.com okay send her a message for your sticky notes so um i hope <laughs> i know norma is, norma is good norma is good you use parkour with erasable pens okay so that's what just placed another ec order oh oh lord okay you really what did you get in that order because we like to know what we got in each order um, but am I going to be getting something? Yes. I mean, there's some things that we're realized. I'm realizing you made too many, mis make too many mistakes not to use sticky notes. Mm -hmm. So certain things I use on sticky notes, um, I put it in my planner and then when I'm sure about what I need to write, then I write it on the page. Like yesterday, I uh, one of my eat the frog goal for yesterday. Oh yeah. So while I'm talking, what is your eat the frog goal for today? What is that one thing that you need or two things that you need to get done today to make sure that today was progressive and accomplished if you can get this one or two thing done for today it will be like it's it it's it like the day has been worth it what is your stuff last night i got two files taken care of that i needed to get taken care of so so that is completely done um which i kind of wanted to do yesterday so i'm finished with that uh as well so yeah today i need to get a dump I need to go to the dump and I'm going to be shredding some um, papers that I have. I have a, a tote, two totes right on top of my counter next to my shredder. I want to go ahead and get that taken care of if possible today. Um, and so if I get those done, it'll be worth it in my home section for the day. Also, the kids started spray painting the vents yesterday. So got to finish those off and get them reinstalled uh, as well today. So let me know what you are. You need to make chicken soup and brisket for the holiday. Okay. 60% off stuff and 50 planner. You want to try the horizontal. Okay. Clean out your room fridge and mop your kitchen floor. You see say and it only shows one of my order. It only show those that ship. No, it should show everything. Uh, make sure you, did you get an order confirmation for that order? 
you write want to write your pen pal letters read and spend time in the word amen amen so that's good for that so yeah um um, yesterday, yesterday I started getting quotes on the septic. Like I didn't want to write down all the places that I called and all the information that they were giving me. I didn't want to write that down on my planner page. And so I would wait until now when I decide who I'm choosing, I will go ahead and write that down on my planner page. But other than that, everything is on sticky notes. Who got a frog eating what? You need to finish writing your two essays um, that's due at midnight. Lisa, get to it. Grown essay. Usually I put your grandkids' school stuff and your cleaning, whatever. Only need one. Yes, Norma. So Norma's on on a, a, a the, her her season of planning right now is quite simple. EC video Tara's like I'm gonna wait. Um, Diamond, eat the frog is basically what's what one thing? What's the biggest thing you got to do today? The or what is the one or two thing that you have to do that will make the biggest impact on your day today? What will make the biggest impact on your progress today? What are those things? That's the frog, and you got to eat that frog early. I don't know, you know, eat the tofu if you vegan. I mean, I don't eat the bean. I don't even know what we can use to say about it, but there's so many things that we can do. Whether it is starting, I need to start to read this book. I need to read a whole chapter of this particular book that I want to read. You know, I need to, what is your eat the frog today or eat the tofu Th throat? What do you do? You woke up with a sore throat. Girl, it might be your allergies acting up too. Do you have um, a throat lozenger? Here is an elephant. Yeah. So, girl, eat that big old elephant. You need to stalk the mailman for your Simply Gilded. That is not what you need to do, Lisa. That's not what you need to do. That's No. They gonna come whether you stalk them or not. You need to find something else to put on your list. You need to organize all those reports. Scheme for changing daily for COVID statistics. Then you need to do a virtual meeting with your colleague workers so you can stay insane. Boom. Okay, Kim. Kim, you got two good ones. Need to tackle the island. Um from your pantry door yes so tackle that island so make sure you guys do your your one main thing that one thing or for the day i need to come up with a hashtag for that so we could probably post what the one thing is but that's too much posting on instagram i'm sorry like i'm just not that instagram posty i like scrolling instagram but i'm not instagram posty all right shelly so shelly said we done for the day so we'll we're gonna close out in prayer uh going to be Working in the back bedroom, the one where you took everything out of the closet, you're going to be in there today. Okay, Norma, get it together. You have to... Oh, have you got two confirmations, and the second one was your lavender. Uh, be nice. Okay, Don, it's, it's his birthday. You need to be super nice today. Be super nice today, okay? And make sure that he has a good birthday. Make sure it's possible. You can do it. Make sure he has a good birthday today. Be nicer to him than you would want him to be on your birthday. Friend, hold on, friend. Let me go right now. Hold on, friend. Let me, wait, let me check Instagram right now. Did you tag me? Did you tag me? Did you tag me in your Instagram? I'm going to let you know right now. Hold on. Did you tag me? Did I don't see I don't know. I don't see if you tagged me there, friend. Yes, you did. Wait a second. Wait a second. Woo chow! Friend. Friend. No, you didn't tag me, friend. Okay, you did not tag a sister. Fra Ooh, yes, friend, friend. Oh yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, yes. Okay, so the way you have them on the card situation, friend, um, is it like that was a whole set? It's it's one set per one set per card that you have. Don't give them your 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 IG, friend. Don't give them your IG. <laughs> <laughs> you can't call in 
getting sick from celebrating your husband's birthday, Diamond. You cannot call in sick. You cannot call in sick from your husband's birthday. Jesse, I wanted them all too when I got them. Ah, friend, friend, woo, woo, okay, friend. <laughs> Okay, friend, you could give him. Cindy, Cindy said, I'm not being nice. I need to be sharing. Sharing is caring. <laughs> sharing is caring. <sighs> okay, so yes, you could give you could give them the IG. Friend, friend, friend. <laughs> Ooh. Um, Jasmine placed her order. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so I'm a I'm a I'm on vacay till Thursday. Okay, so let's wrap up. So you can give it to them, friend. It's okay. But yes, I'm going to go ahead and uh, message you on the ones that I like. I'm going to message you as long as you don't have a headache. Yeah. Yeah. So um, let's close out in prayer. So Diamond, try a throat lozenger. It's probably your allergy because I've had woke up with my throat feeling very, you know, strained and weird for like the past seven, eight days. Um, and it, 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 it's heavier some morning, goes away in the afternoon, you know, stuff like that. So try a throat lozenger, cough drop if you, if you have some, and you should be good for a little bit. You should be good for a little bit. I uh, have been watching... Coco Melon with Lacey. No, I have not. I have not. I, I sure enough am ODM you, girl. Probably want some if you can't see. Cause yes, I sure enough will message you. So, y'all don't be bombarding friends. She only got so much washi on her washi roll, okay? Okay? <laughs> uh, honey cough drop works well. So, Kim, you've been doing that. Okay. You just saw her obit you. Oh, man. Oh, man. All right, y'all. So let's pray out. Thank y'all so much for um, uh, chilling with me today, tarrying with me for this while. I do appreciate each and every one of you. It is my prayer for y'all that you guys remain safe and covered with the blood of Jesus. It is my prayer for y'all that you remain under his wings. It is my prayer for you and your family that you will be blessed when you go out and blessed when you come in. That you will be safe and secure in your homes, in your cars, when you go out on the street, in these stores as well. Please make sure that you all are praying for everyone. The people that are, uh, of course, um, on the line. I can't even say on the front line. People that are on the line that are out there working safe. Uh, working to keep us safe that are losing their lives people that are dying alone family members of those who are also out there on the front line make sure you all pray for every single one of them or on the line i should say because it's not just the, the, the delivery people the people at the morgues i mean everybody there's so many people that we don't see that is working to make sure that we are safe so you keep yourself safe as well so that they can um, perform their job. Please pray for uh, places that are going to be soon running out of supplies. Pray that God helps them to replenish, move in the right way, have things ordered so that they can be replenished of their safety gear, of uh, whatever they need, ventilators, uh, whatever they need, that the needs are supplied completely. We know that these things should come to pass, shall come to pass, and shall happen in the meantime, we just got to pray to God that he continues to strengthen everyone and give them his peace because they need the strength, okay? So let's please pray for all of that. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for your mercy and your grace once again because we never want to be without your mercy. We never want to be without your grace, oh God. So we will continually praise you and thank you for it. We thank you for being the great um, provider for us because you have provided everything that we need. There are some things in life that we simply want, Father God, but you have provided what we need and even in such a time like this, you still provide us with things that we need and we are grateful. So with grateful hearts, we come humbly before you saying, thank you. 
thank you thank you for keeping us safe thank you for keeping the this whole world that is still in your hands that is still in your permissive will oh god help us to be able to get outside of ourselves on a day-to-day -day basis and see you to make sure that we are being your hands and your feet being your ears and your eyes oh god making sure that we're letting people know that you you you're still here you're still providing you're still caring you're still loving you're still full of justice no matter what father god your justice is not our human justice as we understand it and so help us to have the mind of christ jesus help us to have that mind so that we can understand more of you and more of your will help us to know you better day in and day out oh god father we thank you for each other we look forward to spending tomorrow again with each other and with you in jesus name amen thank you all and let me go respond to my instagram and i'll talk to y'all in the morning bye bye